That is so dope. That image is so good. Look at that. What is going on all Green Nord fans? It is JJ here back with another video today taking a look at a, a different, different Green Nord video. It's one that's been highly requested. I think heavily requested, maybe is a better word for it. It is the Green Nord chant, Swanavonek. Now, I did actually take a look at this video once before. Uh, unfortunately, the recording for that corrupted. However, uh, I do think that this is honestly one of... I think this is one of my favorite videos so far that I've looked at from Indonesia fans and so we're going to take a look at it, at least the second half of it because it's a four minute long video uh, and I only made it through about two minutes of it. So we're going to take a look at it uh, in its entirety, hopefully see some stuff that I didn't get to see, see some stuff I did see, see some stuff I didn't get to see and hear the passion, the love for the club, the energy from the Green North 27 themselves because they, they are an amazing fan group. They are a fantastic fan group. They, they definitely know how to represent for their squad uh, and for their for their stadium and, and maybe for the country itself, for Indonesia. I, I'm, I'm very intrigued to see uh, what, I, obviously Indonesia fans didn't get a, the greatest start uh, in my eyes because uh, I, I watched the game with them in Malaysia where they attacked the Malaysian fans. So they didn't get the greatest start. However, I wonder what chants are actually brought to that game because there's so much sort of uh, ultras, uh, I guess ultras culture uh, surrounding just the clubs in Indonesia. I don't even, I can't even imagine what the national team is like. So you guys gotta let me know your thought on the Green Nord chant Swara Bonek. But yeah, let's get into the video. As well, guys, you can find the original video just down in the description below. That's this is super dope as well. This is beautiful animations. Persabaya. I don't know how you guys are able. That looks so majestic. For the club, all for the club. Waving the Indonesia flag too. Whoever made this edit deserves oh, a huge oh, pay raise. I mean, I hope, hope they, 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 they got it. Memang saya ketahui, saya ketahui dari ya dari pengalaman saya secara langsung. Lagu itu diciptakan oleh Oka, tapi lagu Suara Bonek itu manifestasi perwujudan dari ya Suara Bonek. Suara bonek mungkin tidak hari ini, tidak cukup hari ini saja. Jadi lagu itu kan sebenarnya menggambarkan soal. Uh, I mean, I mean obviously, I, I mean I can't understand necessarily. I, I'm not not what he's saying, but the majority, I guess, of what's going on uh, in the video. However, I I can definitely sort of decipher the sort of passion and the energy and why the green note and why the leaders of the green note why the chance water bonek means so much to them. I mean, it's it's unbelievable. Mengembalikan Persebaya. Uh, I've said this once before, and I will say it again. What is the infatuation with Indonesia fans and, and taking their shirts off? Everyone here pretty much has their shirt off. I don't understand the Indonesia fans. I get it's probably really hot there. I guess I guess that makes sense. But my goodness. What does the shark do? Are they, are they is the person by a squad that have something to do with sharks? I don't, I don't really. I guess I guess that's something I need. I need for more for you guys. Takkan pernah ragu, takkan pernah ragu tak ada kata mundur sebab mundur adalah pengkhianatan. Sebab mundur adalah pengkhianatan itu representasi atau mewakili sikap bonek waktu itu ketika memang persebaya itu hanya belum dibolehkan taknya belum diakui oleh PSSI jadi memang menentukan sikap tak pernah mundur artinya itu perwujudan bahwa memang lirik lagu yang disampaikan suara bonek itu ya benar adanya itu tidak retorika tidak asal membuat lagu jadi lagu ini kan repre representasi dari apa yang sebenarnya sudah ada takkan pernah lagu tak ada kata mundur I love the passion. I thank, thank, thank these lyrics. I actually, I want to, uh, so I remember this is probably why I stopped the first video. I feel like, because I obviously I, I had technical issues, but I, 
I really do like the, the, the subtitles because it gives me, uh, someone who obviously is not from Indonesia, uh, it gives me something to go back and I, I know Google Translate isn't the greatest thing, but it at least gives me something to gauge off of, uh, sort of what the Swan and Bonac chant is about, but I, pro I, I promise I'll, I, won't inter I won't interrupt anymore. I, I won't interrupt the song anymore. Now the flag's going. We got the to we got the toiletries going. I'm digging that jersey. That jersey to the far right is pretty dope. From the from that angle, that this just looks like insanity from that ang that's such a beautiful angle that's a good angle that is also amazing all the flags going all the fans leaning over the railing just going absolutely crazy that's it's so cool Okay, so I yeah I do I do need to stop the video here just for a second. I I do need down in the comments below someone to hopefully in English give me sort of a synopsis or, or a summary of what the Swan and Bonac chant is about. I I feel like it's about Persevaya. Obviously, I feel like it's it's about it's a tribute or a passion uh, of of the fans of the Green Door itself. But obviously, you know sometimes you get misinterpreted in the songs. Maybe it's just like a rally cry to the song or to the team itself. So. But if it was so dope, this is so, this is, this is why I love these types of videos. This, that right there, the leader is just looking so hard. He's chilling. He's, at, he's, he's the biggest amount of chilling. And then the fan culture, just everyone ramp it up. Lirik lagunya, saya pribadi berkesimpulan bahwa ini lagu dengan lirik yang terbaik dari semua lagu-lagunya. I cannot wait for the season to begin once again, guys. I'm, I'm actually, I'm, I'm anticipating the start of the season. That is so dope. That image is so. Good. Look at that. Green Nord, Green Nord. I I I bow down. I bow down to the Green Nord. The Swan and Bonac chant. Ob uh, obviously, I wish I wish I knew the chant a little bit better. I think it would take me several several viewings of this video to learn the chant a little bit better. But just I, I mean, just the watching the passion and and just the. I mean, look at the fans just going crazy. The fans chanting, the flags waving, everything going so so well. I mean, look at the, also that dress is super sick. But look, just I mean, I, this it makes me appreciate football more to see fan cultures like these and to see fans like these. And and I mean, video after video, day after day, the fans in Indonesia. I mean, whether it's the Green Noah, Jack Mania, uh, the Brigada Curva Sud, uh, our Mania, you guys are not, you have never disappointed me, not once. It's been amazing, amazing to watch. And Swan Bonek, it has been no different. I mean, just this, this, these last images, I mean, just look, I mean, like, what a way to sort of end a video just by, by capping it off with these, that, I mean, what stadium in England does this? What stadium in France does, this? maybe, maybe the one in Paris, but like, that's so cool. That is super dope. Oh, big up, big up you.
you man, Green Nord, uh, and, and Persebaya. Obviously, I wish you guys nothing but success. And for February 29th, we need it to get here. Or not 29th, sorry. The end of February, we need to get here sooner because we need the Green Nord. We need to see these football games back in action and to see you fans back in action as well. But thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts on the uh, Swatabonek chant down in the comments below. And peace.